Hi guys, today we'll be doing an iOS 9 beta 2 review on the iPod Touch 5th generation. So right here is a new 6 digit passcode on iOS 9. So let me just enter a sample 6 digit passcode. So right here on the home screen you can see the changes in the passbook application and the new look for the podcast application. Also in search, for instance, you are searching something and you click on it. It will go to the app and show you an option to go back to where you came from. Also a change here in settings is the battery setting. Where when you go inside of it, you would see here battery life suggestions. Also that you may now search inside settings as well. Some changes here in the accessibility settings is that there is the new assistive touch in a way that you may now customize on what you want inside of it. Also there is the new touch accommodation which allows you to adjust your settings for touch. Inside the photos application, um, inside photo stream, there, instead of having the heart you have the like and when playing a video such as this one you may now zoom in to the video. Also, in order to edit it, as you can see right here, the trim is now gone. And when you pause it, the menu would show up. And you may now click edit and trim the video. And the share is still the same. In the camera application, there are just some little changes on top on how it used to be. Inside the notes application, you may now create some folders. So for instance, let us make a folder right here. And let's make a note right here. So you can just click the plus sign here and you can see this new formatting ways and let's go and make some note. So right here you can now just check on the items list or something like that and the health application there has been just some little changes I guess on how it looks on landscape mode so here's the multitasking in iOS 9 And here's Siri on iOS 9. Also for handoff, if you're using another iCloud device, you may now access handoff inside of multitask. Like here on how I'm using Safari on my MacBook Air right here. So... Thank you for watching and please subscribe for more and I'll make more videos as the iPod Touch gets an update in iOS 9.